Hello. How are you guys? I'm glad to see you're back. And uh, welcome to the next episode in uh, the Minecraft series. So, we're going to go back and jump back into Rojark. And we'll see where we left off. If memory serves me, we're heading straight into a night of fun. With the invasion mod having kicked off, we still need some torches. So I will kick those up. I'm going to try and concentrate this more on the actual activity in the game. I uh, kind of just see how it goes. So we're going to light up my little raft thing right here. All right, get back out the wood. A little bit more of a fighting platform, maybe. Let's see what I can build up before anything gets here. Biggest thing, creeper hits me. But I can fight from the water. I plan to just dive straight into the water when they get here, and then I can like poke out them from underneath. Poke them from underneath. Stay out, melt. Pokey, poke, poke. They're not too difficult yet. Haven't been around in this area in the game long enough to really uh, see them getting too difficult. Well, we have some time. Uh, okay, that's it. Whoa. Spiders are super dangerous. Their length reach seems to be just as long as I am. My, my character's reach. Don't be breaking my stuff. Ah, breaking it. Stop it. Stop it. That's mine. Alright. Got those guys. And if I collect up one stack of uh, the rotten flesh, you can actually end up um, eating the whole stack. And then it ends up allowing you to recover most of a hunger bar. But it doesn't give you any of the all important well fed status, which is new to. Oh, that's right, I got armor on. Uh, see, I'm smart. I'm smart. But it doesn't give you any um, benefit like the uh, well-fed does. See, if I hover over this, we see it kind of glows yellow. That's indicating that I'll get a well-fed status, meaning that I'll recover health. Um, I don't know quite what else it does. I'd have to read up on it. All right. We're just keeping our ears open for the next intrusion. Let me know if you hear him. Oh. There he is. Oh, creeper. Zombie. Son of a gun. That's a skeleton. He's firing his bomb arrows at us. See how much easier the water makes the night? You can take them on one at a time. And as long as I'm vigilant, I'll be able to get after him. Ah, oh. Jesus. Playing finger twister over here. Alright. What are you doing? What are you doing there, Mr. Zomber? Digging your way out of a tunnel? Digging his way out of a tunnel. Look at them all. Doing some landscaping for me. You know, I appreciate a hardworking zombie. They are a nice addition to the workforce. I just wish they would listen to orders. Follow direction. They're not good at that. That's the part they struggle with. Oh! Got it. Back to the water. <laughs> I'm getting too... Oh, okay. Oh, boy. Oh, we're in for <laughs> Not a good idea. They're really dangerous in hordes like that. I'm going in the water. Okay. Surface for air. Come back down. One at a time. Hopefully the sword holds out. Oh man. Cannot get cocky. That spider. Or not spider, you know, a skeleton. Firing those bomb arrows. Oh, Jesus. Whew. Okay. I'm running out of wood. I'm running out of base. 
Do I have another sword? I do. Double creeper attack. Hopefully. Don't blow up. Don't blow up. Don't blow up. Okay, let me in the water. Let me in the water. Okay. Alright, alright. Okay, not too much damage. Now I need my drinking cup. Son of a gun. Drinking cup, drinking cup. Where the heck did my drinking cup go? Do you guys see it? Is it in my inventory? Okay. Definitely need the drinking cup. Next. Alright, zombie's kind of stuck. I'm not. Stay away, stay away. Alright. Come on, daytime. I'm running out of stuff. Daytime. I need you so. Come on. Come on. Oh, baby zombies. Aren't they creepy? They're so small. Uh... That high pitched noise. Okay, he's going over to join daddy, I guess. It's fucked up. Just a little. Just a little bit. Whew. Okay. Cup. Where is my drink? There's my drinking cup. There's, there's my drinking cup. Okay. Lose it again? At least I have a little bit more. Double creeper. Okay. We'll take care of this guy. We'll keep our eyes out as to what's going on in that corner. Stop breaking my base. Okay. Launching zombies at me. Two more cre- that's daytime. That's daytime on the horizon. What are you doing? Just drown already. Oh, I'm so nervous. I'm so sorry. I'm trying. I want to stay alive. Can't fail you guys. Okay, they're trapped. Kind of. Kind of. As I say that, they're jumping right out. Five more zombies. They're all around me, it sounds like. What are you doing? Swimming through the wood. Up next to build, once I get a little more wood, is uh, additional defenses for this stuff. It comes in the form of uh, a one block high wall adjacent to the water so that they can't jump out. And then I'll build little uh, drop dropways in, like this one, but like actually filled with water, so that I can get in there and get back um, out without them trying to like swim up my anus, right up my bum. But for that, I'll need more wood, more water, and all of that requires me to keep food in my belly. And they blew up my chest. Alright, we gotta get that chest. There's the chest. Hopefully he dies. Please die, sir. Please die. Why aren't you dying? Okay, okay. That's enough. That settle down. At least we got a carrot. Okay. Okay. Alright, first order. Pack away a couple of the things that we don't need immediately, food-wise, that kind of stuff. Um, we're going to make up half of these into seeds to plant. Let's store the additional. Flint, we don't need it right now. Oak, I want to replant that for food-wise. Store up that. Keep that for emergency rations. Huck, duck, 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 duck. I need to get my pickaxe. Go get myself some more stone. Okay. All right got so much to do right now so little time but you guys are just kind of i hope just hanging out you want to be here because you want to see uh where the story goes what happens with the adventure and you're not expecting all that much from me i mean i'm gonna try i'm trying hard <laughs> maybe too hard what am i taking thirst 
thirst is the thing I need to manage. I need wood. To get wood, I need to break it. I don't have an axe. What you're seeing is not your own hallucinations. This is me thirsting to death. <laughs> Here I am trying to be a tryhard, and now I'm dying because I can't see straight. I can't see straight. Again, I'm not seeing straight. How's my health doing? I'm not dying yet. And the next thing, and water. Okay. And unfortunately, the cups are kind of buggy, like you noticed before. They want to jump right out of your pocket. And back into your inventory. Hopefully, please settle down. There we go. Ooh. Anybody else trying to throw up right now? <sighs> okay. All right. All right, we're all set there. Tuck that back into the inventory. Grab that. Definitely need... Just a little bit of stone. I'm going to try and gather eight. Then we're back to the crafting table. I want to cook up some meat. Now, the additional, uh, no invasion tonight. We get a one night reprieve on every invasion. So I have X number of hours and minutes um, to be able to get to a little bit better position for myself, survival-wise. No cuts. You're going to kind of watch the process. <laughs> Hope you enjoy. No skipping ahead for this crew. That's some iron. Do I dare? Do I dare? Do I dare? Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> I'm still... I'm never going to get used to that sound. Is there three? Do I get three pieces? I only get two. I'm only... Okay. And we're back out. We got to go cook up the bread and see if we can't get ourselves some more nutritious food because toast in this game unlike real life gives you more more somehow right um don't exactly know how i wish i did because i would probably use it to make more food from a piece of toast because that sounds nice all right come on so my best guess is manure can actually be used to add it to food or add it to growing things to get it back out uh, get back out kind of like bone meal um and actually if i do put this here i can actually recover bone meal out of it i don't know if manure itself can be added for an additional boost we'll have to see all right choosing a class we're going to choose a class what do you think we should have my best guess is I'm playing alone, single player. What's better than a hermit? What do you think? Ten cooking, five mining, five digging. All right, we'll talk about each of those more in depth uh, here coming up. But I'm going to take this one because I'm all alone. There's nobody here. This like, come back, come, come back. Do I have to chase them down? Oh, no. Oh no, alright, alright, alright. Do I have to cage? Oh, is he stuck? He's not stuck, and I'm not sprinting. So. Oh, I still wearing my armor. Take that off. Now I'm moving freer. Yep, that's more mobile. We have more iron. That's iron gravel, unfortunately, not very usable. This is a neat little cave. I wish I could use that and not die from explosions. <gasps> An extra piece of iron. The mining gods are smiling upon us. So as they get a little bit lighter, I think you can harvest back manure. So, as kind of their, their kind of leftovers and leavings accumulate, I'm going to try and harvest them up. So I can go and make myself a farm. But the farm's got to be protected. And I don't want to put it down and then have a zombie attack come and then lose all of that quote-unquote pro uh, progress. I gotta be careful about how I get, how I sus sustain myself to try and not lose out on what I already, I have a lot of points. What should I add it to? I'm thinking I don't want to die. Thinking that's usually a pretty good one, but I also want food. Um, Now, 
forewarning, I have played this before. Farming can get really OP really fast. So I don't think for this I'm actually going to be using it all that much. Cooking, we haven't found it to be OP, uh, so I'm going to keep it. We'll tack some, tack, tack some extra on wood cutting. I know I'm going to have to do a lot of it. I'm going to have to increase mining. Let's get extra attack, because if I can chase down some of these uh, creatures, I want more damage to be able to kill them. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to, that's a big island. I'm going to kill you. Eventually. You're not an adult yet. I don't want to be mean. Okay. <laughs> oh boy. What am I coming to? What am I coming to? Hopefully a fun adventure. Is this a fun adventure? You guys got to tell me. So if and whoever is out there watching, I really want you to get involved. Um, I'd really, really appreciate it uh, if we can talk um, anything like that. I am doing my best, um, but I'm just me right now. Uh, for, yep, just me. <laughs> uh, not surprising on uh, the content, right? But seriously, um, tell me about it. Give me some information. Tell me about what you think. Uh, tell me what you think I should do in these. Play. Anything else, too. I don't want to limit myself to just Minecraft. So, please, uh, please just let me know what you think. Uh, we should get after, and we'll, we'll do our best. Now I'm getting kind of distracted. I actually have um, a couple of friends online, and I'm still learning how to like mute certain things while I'm recording to try and give our, give me and you guys uh, just a chance to play. So I'm still learning. Apologize for that. But we're getting, we're getting quite a bit of wood here. Um, kind of the next step, like I said, fortify the base, get enough food, and we have toast. Lots of toast. Two whole hams for a piece of toast. So, we're going ham with the ham so we can make the ham with the other hams. Alright, we need shears. I want wool. It sounds brittle and weak because it is, but it's nice because we can do cool stuff with it. Okay. I want regular wood. Those are regular wood over there. We're going to go get those. Oh, more points. More wood cutting because I'm going after some wood. That's a regular tree too. Even closer. Any good? That's some good stuff. Can I get down there easily? All right. Yes, I can. All right. You also notice I kind of go through um, regular dirt really, really quick. So don't know what mod interaction that is but it makes regular dirt like that just a breeze to chop through again i don't think that's really a uh, op kind of function i think it's kind of makes sense loose dirt uh, uh regular regular dirt um really isn't that hard to go through when you have roots and tangles and stuff like that makes it pretty darn difficult um I am saying that from experience. <laughs> I do know what digging dirt feels like. Um, I was gardening for quite a bit. Did quite a few summers of it. Um, got paid, so I was a professional. And professionalism is cool. All right, the sun is setting. And I think we're coming to come into the end of this uh this time through i'll pick up we'll play through the night um there really won't be too many mobs spawning um just pause it there so it doesn't keep going we'll build through we will go through um getting the base kind of built up likely at night because i need a lot of light to do that so we'll go in we'll head in we'll improve our little area uh, right here just so you can see we'll give ourselves some bit better defenses um, maybe dig out the channel a little bit more I don't want to do too much water moving but I have extra iron for a bucket and then we'll be able to get into uh, making it more zombie proof giving myself a couple doors more layers of uh, defense so hopefully I don't die that's the whole objective I don't want to die and I want to <laughs> I want to play through quite a few episodes of this um, crazy long big idea um, I want to go like one through probably like 12. 
12 and we'll call that like a season and I'll try and set objectively like a, for the season kind of what we're going to get after but it's all going to be based on survival so we're not getting away from um, uh, going off in creative we're not pulling in crazy mods MODS uh, to be able to fly and build big structures the objective is our hard work here will see us through the day um, so Thank you so much for watching. Hope I didn't bore you too much, but please feel free to come back uh, for episode four in uh, the next release. So thank you all so much for watching. I will see you all around, whoever was out there. Bye-bye.